here. In this video, I'll walk you through how to use our Replit Classroom uh, data export tool um, from Chrome. So this video assumes that you've already installed the extension from the App Store, or you've been given developer access, and you have opened up Chrome. I'm just on codingrooms.com right now. It doesn't matter what site you start from. So your extension will either show up here, or if you have a lot of extensions, you might have to scroll down and pin the Coding Rooms extension. Then you can open up the Coding Rooms extension here, the export tool. And if, you don't, if you're not on Replit, it will provide you a link to go to Replit. So let's follow that link. So I just opened up a new tab with my Replit classroom here, and I have some demo courses that we're going to export. So once I've loaded the page here, I'll open up the extension again, it will initialize and load in all the classrooms that I have. So I can select to include student um, data and submissions in my export, or I can e exclude that. By default, we exclude that data. Um, for this time, I'll select it, and I'll go ahead and select this classroom. So you can select as many classrooms as you want, or you can just export a single classroom. When you're ready to go, click Export Your Data. It will ask you whether or not you're ready to start the export and include your student list and submissions. Click OK. So initially we calculate uh, how long the export will take. And you can see now the export is, is actually running. And it shows that I have 225 different requests that it needs to run in order to complete the export. So while I'm waiting for the export, I can click out of this. I can actually go to another tab and do something else. Um, and come back to uh, Replit or even see from another tab the progress. Now we don't suggest opening up multiple Replit tabs during this process uh, as it could interfere with the loading that's happening in one of the tabs. So we're still waiting here for the export and I'll be right back when the export is complete. Okay, so our export is almost done, um, and when you see it complete, it will actually download the exported um, data file to your downloads. So we finished, we immediately see the stats on what I exported, how many assignments, and how many submissions. Um, and for me in Chrome, the download file popped up here. So that's it. You've exported all the data that you wanted from Replit Classroom, and in the next video, I'll show you how to import that into Coding Rooms. Thanks for watching.